I was 19 in 1969 to 1970 was my first year drawing. 48 years, just ending 48 seasons. Well, my brother was a patroller and neither one of us could afford lift tickets. So when he was patrolling, I was able to get a free lift ticket. And then he got busy in school working on his master's degree. So I had to either come up with money or quit skiing or join the patrol. So I decided to join the patrol. So ever since, you know, it's been my free skiing. You know, that's the way to do it. And as far as sewing, that was when I was smoke jumping. I learned to uh, sew in the parachute loft because you don't just hang out waiting for fires, you have jobs to do. The only thing the jumpers don't make is the parachutes. I learned to sew in there, started with canteen covers. <laughs> I jumped for nine years, 38 seasons in the fire business. Started McCall jumping in 75 and I didn't learn to sew until I got to Boise and then uh, went to Alaska and was sewing up there. Great Basin smoke jumpers, they're always considered the, the other guys, you know, like the pirates, <laughs> the guys that, that uh, attack. <laughs> and, and uh, maybe get away with the rules a little bit, you know? <laughs> My background a little bit with the jumpers is when you pack a parachute, you're taking on the responsibility of somebody's life that's going to use it. So I've learned that you make it once, make it right, and you don't have to try to fix it. And it's important to do it right the first time. I didn't sew for quite a while until just the last few years. Panda poles. Well, it's interesting, I think, this the way technology sometimes finds out that the way they've been doing things for years and years isn't always the best way, that there's other alternatives. You know, the way things have changed is we're not as disposable as, as we used to be. It's better to watch what we're doing, but not everybody does it. It's always worth trying something different, you know, modifying or checking it out, trying to see if there's a better way. But eventually you get to a point where if it's right, don't mess with it. A shortcut or, or a slight change in materials that caused the problem, you know. It's really too bad hemp has got such a bad rap because it's good material as far as textiles go. Bamboo can convert a lot of the textile with the new technology. When I look at, at one of these, even if it's, though it's simple, you try to do it the same way every time.